Happy Halloween! in so freaking long but yeah so really last minute i'm about to go to target pick up some stuff for her for sharon for her little housewarming thing because she moved into her new apartment but and then what else do i have to update you on yeah i hit 25,000. thank you so much love you so freaking much i actually met a subscriber yesterday one of my little supporters i love you guys so much if you ever see me in person please say hi because like when i say I give her the biggest hug I was blushing literally but anyways what else I went to New York like last week I have footage of that I'm gonna include that later in the vlog and what else I went to the Christian Louboutin opening in DC that was really cute but yeah all that will be later my costume is really cute I'm a cute little alien but yeah let's go to Target and yeah you're coming with me of course I made it to Target and this is the quietest Target has ever been I think because it's literally Halloween weekend look there you are you're right there This is cute. This is cute. I'm gonna get this. I love living with my mama, but I can't wait to decorate my apartment. Like, I feel like that's gonna be so freaking fun. I was gonna do one of these, but I don't really know what these are for, to be honest. So, I think I'm gonna get her the throw, the throw covers for like the bed. This looks so freaking soft, so I'm gonna get this. Okay, so as of right now, all I have is the mirror and a little throw a throw cover thing for her bed. So I don't know what else I'm gonna get. If I can't find anything else, I'm gonna just, I mean, she, she's gonna live there for a good minute. I can just keep adding on to her apartment. <laughs> but yeah, so probably let's go because I need to be out of here soon because I'm a little late already, but yeah. Guys, please, this is why I can't go shopping by myself because I forgot wrapping paper. I got everything except wrapping paper, so literally, this is just gonna sit in the freaking bag. Oh my gosh, it's so hard recording the freaking car. What the heck? Will this even fit? <laughs> Bro, what? Like, it won't go in. I bought this from the dollar store, so I'm just about to just wrap every freaking thing. But, anyways, let's go in. I'm gonna talk a little bit more when I get home because I got a lot to say. But yeah, let's go. You look so cute. Can I go to can I get a video of you when you're, um, I think, what is your, oh, you didn't put it on yet. No, I didn't put it on yet. Let me show, show you. Brownies. Oh, Sydney, <laughs> can you pass me your ID from please? I'll tear it Oh, my God. Shout out to my y'all old So, you guys saw me. I got the mirror and the blanket. Thank you. But there was you know that. You so funny? I really actually needed that. We'll give it what, back. the mirror? <laughs> the mirror? Oh, yeah. Tell the angels I said hey. Oh, Sharon says hey. Hi, but angels. <laughs> I'm about to change. <laughs> Come and get your cookies, girl. Scott, Are you cookies. sick? Come and get your Do you cookies. you need a nurse? Call Alien her. Superstar. Nana. Period. Girl Scout brownies. Come and get your brownies. Hey. Who has the best costume? Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh, Perfect. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh
different age groups or whatever. And I, I'm gonna like scream. I, I cannot talk. I'm so tired. I screen recorded the whole thing because my mom FaceTimed me, and they were all like, "Oh my gosh!" Like, "Hi!" And I was like, "Oh my gosh!" Hi! I'm gonna like put it right here. And it is so crazy that like, like. Like, I have, like, some people who support me in my content and who just love, you know, seeing me and, like, see me pop up on their TV or phone or whatever they watch me on. I'm like, that's crazy. Even the supporter that I met yesterday, I literally met her at church. And I was, like, coming in the bathroom and she was walking out. And she, as soon as, like, we, like, locked eyes, she was like, I watch you on YouTube. I was like, oh, my God. You're like, give me a hug. And literally, like, when I say my resting phase, it's not the nicest because she was like, I always, like, you know, I see you, but I don't know how to say hi. And I literally told her, like, if you ever see me again, just come and say hi. As soon as I start talking, I literally just start smiling. Like, literally. But my resting face is not the nicest. So I understand, I understand. But if you're seeing this, and you ever see me in person, literally, literally just come give me a hug. And it's so crazy, because if you're new here, I don't, leave, I don't leave the house like that. Like, I'm a house girl. But... Which is why my man, when I get a man, hopefully he's a house boy because why are you outside all the time? But that's besides the point. But yeah, I'm a house girl. So I always think like if I actually left the house, like I'll probably see like more, you know, people who watch my content and like support me and stuff like that. But when I do step out and I do see people who like recognize me, it makes me so happy because obviously this dream of mine wouldn't come to pass if, you know, nobody was watching. Like what? Of course I think I would still do it just because it makes me happy documenting my life and stuff but it's like if people aren't watching obviously your dreams aren't gonna come true but yeah so obviously if people aren't watching and i'm gonna just go in with my face wash y'all know y'all know this is what i use for the face and guys my birthday's coming november 12th and i'm having a bad case of birthday blues i just haven't been feeling like doing anything I haven't vlogged haven't picked up the camera all week and literally my friends, my friend, not my friend, my friend was like, Bethany, like, what are you doing? Like, pick up the camera. And I'm like, okay, 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 okay. But anyways, new year is coming. I'm about to be 24, 24 aware. But anyway, let me wash my face and brush my teeth and go to bed. Do I have anything else to update you on? No. Still getting married in two years. Still no boyfriend in sight. Um, God is good all the time. All the time, God is good. What else? What else? yeah guess that's it tonight was cool i'm just not a social girl like if it's like me and my girl my girlfriend hanging out okay but it's, when it's a lot of people i just get really really quiet um what else uh, yeah that's pretty much it i'll probably catch you tomorrow yeah you don't have one of those cameras that you can like look at yourself Oh, that's what I was talking about. So you're right. In one mile, keep it. Look like we in a Spider-Man movie or something. So I'm at the... Literally did my makeup in the car, but I think it came out cool. Let me show you. Hopefully I did a good job. This is what it's looking like, but I'm about to change in the bathroom and get started. And the theme is like all nudes, like neutral tones. So I'm doing this really cute set. <laughs> This is the cute little set. I'm a little ashy though, so I'm gonna ask one of the models for some lotion. Okay. Hold on, wait a minute. All good, just a week ago. At my house, we party every weekend. So on the radio, that's my favorite song. Make me bounce around like I don't know, like I won't be here long. Now the thrill is gone. Got no patience, cause I'm not a doctor. Go high as you mind. Why you Mufasa? Yeah, me Casa su casa. Got it stripping like Gaza. Got so high on volcanoes. Now the flow is so lava. Yeah, we spit that saliva. I phone got message from Viber. Either the head is so hydra or we live by God. By God, my God, you pay for your friends. I'll take that as a compliment. Got a house full of homies. Why I feel so the opposite. Incompetent ain't the half of it. Saturdays with young lavish. Just sad as shit is. I'm bad as it. Beats they took from the cabinet. Sorry, sorry. I'm just scared of the future. Till 2005, I got your back with you. Hold up. No matter what you say, what you do, when I'm alone, I'd rather be with you. Fuck these other niggas, I'll be right back inside. Till 2005. Hold up. 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 Vlogging on my phone. We made it. Aquia is buttering herself up with oil. Oh, not now. Okay. And I realized I forgot my bag. 
driving around with no wallet, no ID. It's okay. I do that all the time. No card. What if I what if I need an ID to get into this place? That's okay. They know who I am. Yeah. Period. Yeah. Let's go say hi. Hi guys. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go meet um Christian Louboutin. <laughs> Running back from the way it was, jump quick to the paycheck. Running back to the strip club, I'm never going back, never going back. No, you can't make me. Never going back, never going back. They never take me. I've been enough of petty dudes. I've been enough of shitty news. I had a thing for dirty shoes since I was 10. Love dirty men are like, ooh, better day than cash today. Ooh, I just take it day by day. So how are you chewing? The gum is on this side. Good morning on my way to church like I told you I literally went to sleep at like two something I just be up and that's not good I'm trying to change my sleep schedule so I can go to bed or like be in I be in bed at like 12 but I don't go to sleep till like one two three but that's bad hence why I be having like bags sometimes but that's literally my fault but I don't know if you can hear like sometimes I don't know I need to like adjust my camera little monitor thing what is it called um my car mount i need to adjust it because it keeps like moving and making all these weird sounds so i'm trying to like hold it in place but it's a really gloomy day today so after church i'm probably should i bother sharon should i bother sharon or should i go home and be in my bed i haven't decided yet but we're gonna see because i'm going to church with sharon i'm driving to sharon's house i literally saw her yesterday at the housewarming but yeah so i'm driving to sharon and then sharon's gonna drive there Honestly, I'm probably just gonna bother sharing because I don't got anything else to do today. But <laughs> overall, this week was chill. I'm picking up the camera slowly more now because I am getting out my because I'm getting out my funk. Every time like I drive, I see my dream car, so I thought that was my dream car. That's why my head literally like broke like that. But anyway, yeah. So on my way to Sharon Church. <laughs> This series in church is so good, so I'm really excited to go to church today. But yes, I'll pick back up, I guess, after church. The Bible says in Proverbs chapter 27, verse 3, as a man, as a woman, as he thinks in his heart, so is he. In other words, whatever you believe is going to be the course that your life takes. So the enemy's entire strategy is let me change what they believe. The first thing we've got to do is we've got to be able to identify the lies that we've believed. How, how do I do that? I was talking to somebody who, who worked at a bank and, and, and they said, you know, uh, working at a teller at a bank and, 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 and they, they, they taught us how to, identify, count, how to identify counterfeit money. They said there's too many versions of counterfeit money to train you on all the variations of counterfeit. So what we're gonna do, instead of showing you counterfeits, we're gonna show you the real thing. Hear me, there are too many lies of the enemy to figure out which one is a lie, what's the new, but if I know the truth of God's word, if I know what truth looks like, if I know what he says about me, anything that comes into my life that does not line up with the truth that I know, I'll recognize it as a counter. Do you know God's word? Okay, can I pour some truth in you just for a second? Psalm chapter 23 verse 1 says this. The Lord is my shepherd. I lack. Why is my blink on? It's supposed to be. <laughs> Sharon, stop. <laughs> Guys, it's days later and I'm back with Sharon. I've seen Sharon so much this week. I'm tired. Anyway, I'm on my way to the post office. I, yeah, it's days later. Church was amazing. I put some clips in. But I like the part, Sharon, do you remember the part when he was talking about how, like, um, like counterfeit money, basically, and, like, yes. knowing God's word mm -hmm. will, like, you know, put you in check sometimes? Because, obviously, there's a lot of lies that we believe that is not of God. Anyways, that was my favorite part. That's why I included it. But, yeah, I'm on my way to the post office. One of my subscriber supporters DM me on Angels. Angels. I need to start saying that. But what if, like, people don't catch on? That's what I'm saying. That's why you need to keep saying it, because they need to catch on. Oh, Come on, now. 
Anyways, one of my <laughs> angels DM'd me on Instagram and was asking like if I could send her one of my V part wigs. So I literally am doing that right now and I added another little wig for her. But yeah, just what'd you say? That's so nice. Thank you. I'm trying to be a good um, citizen. Um, yeah. But <laughs> but hopefully she likes it. Um and yeah, just if you ever like have anything to say to me, like literally and you don't want to comment it, literally DM me. Even if you want to tell me something you agree, disagree, you just want to talk, literally, I literally answer, like, every DM, every comment. Literally does. Yeah. <laughs> because, I, I don't know. I feel like taking time out of your day to, like, tell me how you're feeling and stuff. Like, I want to talk to you, too. But anyways, on my way to the post office, and then when we go home, I'm going to show you a little new sponsor that I have. Ooh, drop down in the comments what y'all think it is. You'll see, when, <laughs> you'll see it when I get home. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. I think this one is, like the coolest one that I've had so far or just like luxury just like ah. Ah, yeah. don't tell them too much God is good God is good anyways I'll see y'all at the post office bye on my way with the wig back at home and I'm so funny because I forgot that at the post office it's better to bring a box instead you have to pay for a box that's like 20 something dollars I'm not doing that because why would I do that when I have so many packages at home? Literally. Literally, this is sitting on my bed. So I'm going to go back out tomorrow and ship the package, but it is getting to her. Safely. Okay? Oh, also, my hair is doing something. Like I told you, I never put you onto anything I don't use for myself. So these clip-ins right here, I literally did an install dedicated video. Literally, I'm going like, to link it up there. So not even like a TikTok. Like I did a whole video on this and how to install the clip-ins. But this time, I installed the clip-ins differently. So my hair under right now is completely braided. And I just clipped it on. Like my hair is not in this at all. But it was cute earlier now because my I put my hood up, I put it down, now my hair looks crazy. But guys... In my last weekly vlog, I mentioned that I have a new sponsor, and I told you that I was going to tell you once the package came. Are you ready? What, well, YSL? Are you serious? Not only is YSL sending your girl stuff, they know my address, they know my first name, my last name. This part right here is not sponsored, but this whole thing, I did an unboxing on it for TikTok, and the video came out so cute. I'm like finishing editing it today. It's like numbered 1 through 24, if you can see, and it's just... It's it's just so cute how many goodies are in this. If you want to see the campaign that I'm recording for them, follow me on TikTok and support your girl or whatever. <laughs> this is crazy to me. It still feels like literally a dream. YSL? YSL um, knows my address? Um, that's crazy. But yeah, so that's crazy. Big news. I want to say thank you for any support you've shown me because obviously, I say this all the time, I would not be getting these deals without you. Literally a mixture of you supporting me my consistency, even though I could be a little bit more consistent, um, and God, obviously. But yeah, so without those three, none of this would be happening. No brand deals would be coming my way, opportunities, nothing. But I will say I'm manifesting, praying for brand trips 2024, okay? And 20, 2024, that sounds insane to say, but 2024 is, um, yeah, it's coming. But yeah, so I'm just going to sit and just talk, yeah. That's what I'm going to do because Sharon left me because she's fake. But anyways, yeah, I just want to say life is so beautiful and I'm going to be 24 very soon. Today is November 1st. Today is November 1st. My birthday is in 11 days. A couple weeks. If you watched my vlog like a couple weeks ago, I said that I was going to do New York and me and Molly were so excited. Yeah, no. Birthday blues hit me like a truck. And now I decided on just doing it in Baltimore with my girlfriends. And we're just gonna have a cute fun time. Of course, you're coming with me. And yeah, nothing, nothing, literally nothing crazy. We're just spending the night in the house, honestly. Girls' night. Um, I may invite like my guy friends too. I don't, you know. I don't know. I don't really. I don't really know. We'll just see how my birthday ends up being. As long as I'm with my girlfriends, like my girlfriends and my cousins, like I'm good. Other than that, do I have anything else to update you on? I'm trying to see. I feel like I updated you on a lot of things in this vlog. Hmm. The time is 4.13 and I need to get back to work, chill a little bit, have some pasta. My mama come home, we're gonna eat some salmon. And yeah, I'm just about to chill for a little bit, but can't chill for too long because I gotta get back to work and I need to start editing. That's what I'm gonna do. I will catch you in the next vlog. Apologies for not being so consistent. Like I have been slacking really badly, but I told you I'm, I'm trying to pick up the camera more often okay so that's what i'm gonna try to do but thank you so much for watching i love you for watching my hair looks a mess let me take my makeup off 
and get to work. But yeah, love you. Bye.